Hey, how come you're always alone when you get in my cab? Just drive. Mita says 23 bucks. Pay up. Thanks, kid. The chapel is cool and placid inside. The lilting classical music and softly flickering candles give the room an air of serene, peaceful redundancy. In fact, it absolutely stinks of tranquility in here. Fawn is standing at the ready at the end of the room. Next to her is a man dressed like some sort of clergyman. Larry, we're all ready for you. We do have one little thing to take care of, though. It's $100 for the marriage certificate, the ceremony, and the decorations. The decorations are extra? If you're too cheap to spring for them, I'll just take them down. Larry, no decorations? No, no, leave them up. I'll... I'll take care of it. Of course you will, Larry. After all, how often does a man who isn't Larry King get married? It's a video slot machine. Have they no shame? Those new PFLs, penile fluorescent lights, get very bright and generate a lot of heat, but they burn out quickly. The pews are cordoned off with decorative ribbons. This is to prevent anyone from actually using the pews, which might then require that they be cleaned or otherwise tended to. Hot dog! Now we're ready to knock this thing out. Finally! You all settle into basic position. A hush falls over the players at home. Barely beloved. Sorry, let me restart that. Merely beloved. Jim? <laughs> Sorry, sweetie. You know how I get. Dearly beloved, we are gathered here today to join this main and this woo main. Blah, 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 blah. Do you, Lance Lassiter, take this woman? It's Larry. <laughs> Larry Laffer? I thought you said. Just go. Do you, Larry, Larry Laffer, take this woman? Blah, blah. Sickness and hell forsaken and the rest. I... I do. Do you, Fawn Forschwanger? Forschwanger? Take this man to be... to be your blah blah blah, honor and comfort and bail? Right. I, I mean... I do. You've got the ring. I have to have another ring? No, no, no. I've already got the ring. Keep this thing moving. Then by the power invested in me, Jimmy Ted hereby declares you done and done. Congratulations, pleasure doing business with you. I'm headed down to the wine cellar. It's inventory time again. <laughs> Employees only, I'm sure y'all understand. Fawn throws her arms around you and almost kisses you. Oh, Larry, isn't it romantic? What's she talking about? Did something romantic happen here by mistake? I'll meet you at the honeymoon suite, Larry. Ready to give you my all, my everything, my very soul. Don't keep me waiting. I can't wait to take advantage of you. She's not done with that yet? Well, congratulations, Larry. You're a married man. Time to get over to the honeymoon suite and hang a sign on the door. Gone consummating.
It must be the honeymoon suite. Is that you, Larry? Larry. It sure is, baby. Come on in. I'm ready for you. You walk into the honeymoon suite. Your blushing bride is waiting for you. Hello, Larry. You're here at last. Forgive me if I'm a little shy. I've never been with a man who meant so very, very much to me. Excellent! Not now, Larry. I need music! Larry, we're married now. No more talk. No more dancing. It's time for you and me to consummate. I just need some music or something. You know, let's make the mood even more perfect. Technically, that's not possible. Shut up. I mean, don't be that way, oopsie poopsie. You tweak the radio dial. There's nothing but static on this station. You tweak the radio dial. There's nothing but static on this station. You tweak the radio... Jeez, why can't they make a radio that gets stations at all these little numbers? We'll be back to our commercial-free four-hour Barbra Streisand Marathon after this commercial message. I don't understand that. How many times has this happened to you? You've just gotten married, and you forgot to get the perfect bottle of wine for your honeymoon. Don't ask the hotel to send up their finest bottle of rotten, overpriced garbage. Don't settle for trashy, boxed wine they sell at the convenience store. The taxi driver will probably drink it all and you'll end up in a fiery crash. Don't let that happen to you. Call Snappy Liquors. We deliver anywhere, anytime, in five minutes or less. How do we do it? That's what I'd like to know. Simple. We buy in bulk and pass the savings on to you. That doesn't answer the question. So call now, 555-8039. That's 555-8039. Liquor quick with snappy liquors. And now, back to more Barbara. Fawn turns off the radio. I thought you wanted music. Larry, wine would be even better than music. I don't know why I didn't think of that before. Go order us some of that wine, Larry, please. It'll make everything absolutely perfect for our, you know, canubial joining. That's so romantic. Right away, dearest. The diver holds her nose and points to your mouth. Wow, Larry, your bad breath is even penetrating the aquarium walls. You again? Oh, Sal and Dispatch must be playing a nasty trick on me. Meter says 23 bucks. Pay up. Thanks, kid. Hello, Snappy Liquor Delivery. We deliver liquor in a snapper. Yes, I just heard your ad on the radio, and I'd like to purchase some fine wine. 
Where do you want it delivered? The honeymoon suite at Caesar's Palace, please. And step on it. All of our fine wines have been stepped on, sir. That's why they're fine. Oh, very sophisticated. And your order has been processed. We'll send one of our hottest young men immediately. Thanks for calling. What did he mean, hottest? Taxi! Where am I taking you now? Meter says 23 bucks. Pay up. Thanks, kid. for you.